I know you mentioned Chop Robinson to me. Chop Robinson, interesting prospect, fun prospect. He, he's going to be fun to watch for a few years. His arms aren't the longest for being uh, as tall as he is. He's six foot three, close to six foot four. His arms end up being like 32 inches. Um, not the length that you want out of a defensive end, but he uses his tools extremely well, including his arms. Basically, he plays the offensive lineman to wherever their possession is, and he goes against them and gets around them. That's his whole game. How does he get around them? And he uses... 32 and a half inch arms extremely well for that because if they have his hands on his pad he swipes and just gets around him it's something that you see consistently and i saw a lot of penalties that should have been on the offensive lineman when they were lined up against him that happens in the nfl sometimes hopefully he goes to a prestigious team so that he gets the calls that he needs it's good that he's faster than he is strong because if a guy just wins with barely enough strength that tends to not work so well in the nfl because the guys are bigger and stronger he always has a really good first step and a strong first step so it's not just fast he has when i say he's faster than he is strong he still has requisite play strength that you want out of a defensive end he's projected to go somewhere in the second round He's not going to be necessary to take with the number nine overall pick. He's not like a can't miss prospect. Um, He's not. That's the reason he's not in the first round. 